Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In this video, we have another very, very interesting question from algebra. We have to solve 2x plus 1 whole square over x plus 1 whole cube equal to 96 for the real values of x. So let's get started by writing denominator cannot be 0. So our answer x cannot be negative 1. Now I will multiply in the numerator and denominator by 8 here. Now we can write our equation as 8 times 2x plus 1 whole square over we can write 8 as 2 cube times x plus 1 whole cube equal to 96. Now I can club these two as our powers are same. So I can write 8 times 2x plus 1 whole square over 2 times x plus 1 and then whole cube. RHS is 96. Now I can divide both sides by 8. So let us divide by 8. This will be over. This will give us 12. Now LHS is 2x plus 1 whole square over 2x plus 2 whole cube equal to 12. Let me write here 2x plus 1 whole square over 2x plus 2 whole cube equal to 12. Now I will consider substitution. 2x plus 1 equal to 1 over y. x cannot be equal to negative half. Let's check. If I will plug in over here negative half. So numerator will be minus 1 plus 1 whole square over half whole cube. So 0 is our LHS which is not equal to 96. So I can say we can consider 2x plus 1 equal to 1 over y where x cannot be negative half. So I can write 2x plus 1 whole square first and denominator we can write 2x plus 1 plus 1 whole cube. Now here I will write 1 over y. Here also I will write 1 over y. So this will become 1 over y whole square over 1 over y plus 1 whole cube equal to 12. Or I can write 1 over y square over y plus 1 whole cube over y cube equal to 12. So in numerator y will be there and in denominator it will be y plus 1 whole cube. RHS is 12. Now we have to add 1 and subtract 1 in the numerator in this way and then we will split numerator in this manner. So I can write y plus 1 over y plus 1 whole cube minus 1 over y plus 1 whole cube equal to 12. Now let's cancel y plus 1 with denominator y plus 1. So it will be power 2 left. I will write 1 over y plus 1 whole square minus 1 over y plus 1 whole cube equal to 12. Now substitution is obvious. 1 over y plus 1. Let's say it is t. So our equation will become t square minus t cube equal to 12. Remember t is 1 over y plus 1 and 2x plus 1 is 
y. Let me write our cubic equation here. T cube minus T square plus 12 equal to 0. Or we can write T cube minus T square plus 8 plus 4. This is 12 equal to 0. 8 we can write it is 2 cube. Then we have minus T square and 4 is 2 square equal to 0. Or we can write T cube plus 2 cube minus is common. So in the bracket T square minus 2 square equal to 0. Now we can use two identities A cube plus B cube here and difference of two squares formula here. So I can write here t plus 2 times t square minus 2t plus 4 minus t plus 2 t minus 2 equal to 0. Now t plus 2 is overall common. So in other bracket we have to write t square minus 2t plus 4 minus t plus 2 equal to 0 or I can write t plus 2 times t square minus 3t plus 6 equal to 0. So from this equation we can conclude either t plus 2 equal to 0 or t square minus 3t plus 6 equal to 0. Let me write here minus 3t plus 6 equal to 0 and t plus 2 equal to 0. So from second equation we will be getting t equal to negative 2. And from this equation, if I will use discriminant formula only, so it is b square minus 4 times a times c. So b is the coefficient of t which is negative 3 whole square minus 4 times coefficient of t square is a which is 1 and c is 6. So 9 minus 6 times 4, 24 we will get negative 15. Once discriminant is negative, it will generate complex solutions. So we can reject this quadratic equation for our real solutions. Now t equal to negative 2. If I will write the value of t, the substitution of t, it was 1 over y plus 1 equal to negative 2. Let's take reciprocal. So y plus 1 will be equal to negative half. Subtract 1 from both sides. So y will be equal to negative 1, negative 1 over 2, which will give us negative 3 over 2. Now I will calculate 1 over y, the reciprocal, so it will become negative 2 over 3 and 1 over y was 2x plus 1. So 2x plus 1 equal to negative 2 over 3. Let us write here 2x plus 1 equal to negative 2 over 3. Now subtract 1 from both sides, 2x will become negative 2 over 3, negative 1, which we can write negative 2 over 3, negative 3 over 3. So this will become negative 5 over 3. So 2x equal to negative 5 over 3. Now divide both sides by 2. We will get our answer as x equal to negative 5 over 6. Now we will verify our result. So let me write here check. Equation is 2x plus 1 whole a square. So I will write the 2x value. This will be 
negative 5 over 3. So I can write our LHS as negative 5 over 3 plus 1 whole square in the numerator over x plus 1. So I will write minus 5 over 6 plus 1 whole cube. Now I will take LCM. So numerator will give us negative 2 over 3 whole square over denominator will become 1 over 6 whole cube which will give us 4 over 9 times 216. Now I can cancel these two numbers so it will be 24 here. 4 times 24 is 96 which is our RHS. So our final answer becomes x equal to negative 5 over 6. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Till next video. Bye bye and take care of yourself.